the national. Now, May Day celebrations have turned violent in Donetsk and eastern Ukraine. That's where thousands of anti-government activists have occupied the regional prosecutor's office and raised the flag of the self-proclaimed Donetsk Republic. Local health authorities say 26 people were injured. RT's Paula Slea witnessed the assault. Violence has erupted here in front of the prosecutor's office. As you can see, people are breaking up chunks of pavement and throwing it at the security forces and at the fences. A crowd has gathered. There are stun grenades growing off, as you just heard. People are very, very tense here. It was a demonstration that started off relatively peaceful. People gathering to say and show support for the People's Republic of Donetsk. They then marched here to the prosecutor's office saying that they want to hear the same kind of statements coming from this office, which is usually quite supportive of Kiev. Right now we're hearing people saying fascist, fascist, accusing people here of supporting the fascist regime. What they want is the prosecutor to come out of her office and to pledge support with the people here. The crowd is starting to surge forward and they've actually taken up positions closer to the building. It's almost as if the people in the front row are holding shields and then behind them the crowd is moving. There are people inside the building that are calling on people to move backwards. I can see them through the windows. <coughs> there really is the strong smell of gas in the air. I've seen two people with blood on their faces being taken away from here. This man is showing me that he's got a bullet wound in his chin and you've also got something at the back of his head. I can see blood coming out of the back of his head. He was They're shooting at our heads, not at our bodies. These people are fascists. Dramatic scenes unfolding. We're waiting still to see who else comes out of this building. There obviously were people inside this building. As you can see here, someone climbing over the wall. This is the problem. How do you control the anger? We've now come round to the other side of the building where another crowd has gathered. There's a human shield here with people actually keeping the crowd back from going further inside the building. In the last few moments, the mood here has changed. It's almost celebratory. A loudspeaker has been put up and people are shouting, the building is ours. So for now at least, the situation seems under control. Polislia RT, Donetsk, Eastern Ukraine. Well, German journalists.